It has happened again, Chavra 4 over the scene of a fourth sewer main break in Fort Lauderdale. Crews say it was a 16-inch pipe in Victoria Park that broke and sent raw sewage out into the streets. CBS 4's Ted Scowan is live at the scene with the details. Ted? Hi, Maribel. Well, the encouraging news this afternoon is that sewage flow has stopped. You can look behind me here and see uh, this is where uh, it happened. Crews have been here since 7.30 this morning dealing with this really nasty mess. You can see, though, that the standing water, the standing sewage, that is gone. At one point, though, that raw, untreated sewage was in people's yards and on the sidewalks. It's the fourth sewer main break in the last few weeks in Fort Lauderdale. This time it's a 16 inch pipe in the Victoria Park neighborhood, just east of Federal Highway in the 1600 block of Northeast 5th Street. It stinks. It's nasty. It's horrible. No, when Barry Wiggins woke up this morning, she found a nasty mess outside her home. Came out with the dogs and could barely walk them because the water, or whatever you want to call it, was all the way up to here, the sewage. It's a 16 inch force main that services that area. Um, it broke and discharge went into the streets. Once again, it was raw sewage flowing out of the ground in the middle of a neighborhood. But this time, crews were able to stop the flow relatively quickly. Crews responded immediately and were able to shut down some pump stations in the area. That enabled them to isolate the break, which means that no more sewage is running through the damaged portion of the pipe. As a result, no more discharge uh, is going into the street. With the flow stopped, utility workers are able to repair the pipe to get the sewage moving again to the treatment plant. Now the focus is cleanup. Now the priority is focusing on bringing in tanker and vacuum trucks to remove the standing water from the street. Sewage problems began December 10th in the upscale Rio Vista neighborhood when a 54-inch main broke, sending untreated sewage through the neighborhood and into the river. A second break in the same pipe made it even worse. That was followed up by another break, this time a 48-inch pipe in the same line under the Himmershie Canal. At this point, all the flow has been stopped as crews work to repair the lines. And a live look now where city crews are still out here trying to clean everything up. You can see one of the Fort Lauderdale trucks right here. It's just behind it. That's where that, uh, where that break was and all that water was standing. I asked the city spokesperson what is being done to stop all the breaks of these old pipes. He told me that it is a top priority to modernize the system. He went on to say that the city will be spending more than $600 million over the next five years in that modernization effort. Live in Fort Lauderdale, Ted Scouton, CBS4 News.